Then we'll have to fight and she's gonna be Dolce and Cabana, Fendi and Adana, Karen, they be sharing all their money, got me wearing fly. Girl, but I ain't asking, they say they love my ass and seven jeans to religion. I say no, but they keep giving, so I keep on taking. And no, I ain't taking, we can keep on taking. I keep on demonstrating my love, my love, my love, my love. Hey guys. It is so magnificent with another vlog, another weekend or whatever you want to call it. It's a vlog, either way. But um, thank you guys for tuning in to my channel again. I appreciate the love y'all been giving me on all of my videos. Um, it is been greatly appreciated that you guys are watching my videos. But I need y'all to subscribe. Can y'all do that for me? I just need y'all to subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Subscribe to your girl. Then hit that notification bell, too, so you'll know when I'm posting. You won't miss a thing if you do that. So, um, I'm about to get ready to go uh, to an appointment. I got off work a little early uh, for an appointment, and then I'm going to get my feet done, and then I'm going to um, get my lashes done again, get a fill in. I need it bad. See, yeah, I got like two lashes on here. Anyway, I just wanted to go ahead and start the vlog. And I will talk to you guys. I got something to put in my car so I can talk to you guys easier. Um, so, yeah, I'm about to get dressed. I'm not going to wear this. I mean, I wear, wear this to the nail salon, but I'm not going to wear this. And um, so I can get ready to get on my adventure. I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Hey, y'all. I am about to get my lashes done. They look horrible. It's my fault, but... Of course, sort of not my fault because I went to a funeral and I was crying. So, about to get started. Thank you, Jen. Say hello. Oh, oh, hey. <laughs> Good. Don't do your you ad like that. <laughs> Girl, whatever. Do you see what I got on top of my head? A hat. <laughs> All right, guys. I just left the shop to get my lashes done. Y'all like them? Now we're about to go get our nails done. Hmm. Get in traffic and then go get our nails done. And then I'm gonna do I'm gonna go home and do my hair. I promise guys. I'm gonna go home and do my hair. Mm. Promise. I'm gonna do my hair. But we finna get in the car. My skin look horrible. We're gonna work on that too. But I love my laces. They're not real long. They're short. Like I wanted them. I don't know what's going on here. But yeah. We're about to head out. I changed the shape and I'll tell you why. Um, so I find myself getting coughing and now I have to get my coughing nails short. Well, I have to get my nails short anyway because I type a lot at work and um, it's hard to type with long nails. It's very hard to type. I type too slow with, with those long nails. So I got this shape. It fits my hands so good. This is the almond shape. But look at the design, my girl. She she did exactly like the picture. Like it's I love my love my nails. I got my feet done too. Lashes, of course. And um, yeah, so that's it for maintenance this week. I'm not doing. Oh, get my hair. That's not it. I lied. Just a quick. I'm get my hair done Saturday, and um. Let's see, I ain't doing nothing else. I ain't going nowhere. Gas too high. Let's talk about these gas prices, though. I'm while I'm fixing my food. 
Stop at gas prices. Um, they high, okay? And I, you know, my dumb ass went and bought a, um, a car that takes 93. Um, yeah, I'm in hell. <laughs> I mean, hell, I mean, like, really, because now, um, now I have to, um, go to Sam's Club to buy my gas, and <laughs> Sam's Club is not by me, honestly, it's across town, and, um, but that's the cheapest gas, but the good thing is, I work from home, so I don't have to worry about, you know, traveling. I have to worry about traveling for work and stuff like that. So during the week, I stay at home. I don't do much during the week, driving during the week, unless I'm going to the grocery store, you know, miscellaneous stuff. Or if I just really want to go out and get something to eat. But, um, yeah, I, um, I don't know. Mm -mm, I'm going to work. But I'm actually going to, um, let me, all right. But, um, yeah, gas is high and I <clears throat> live in an area where it's affluent people, to be honest. Um, this area is, I, it's got blue collar people and it's got people who got money, honestly. And the gas prices are really high out here, so... I've really been limiting limiting my traveling. Um, today is the most I've traveled this week. I had to drive like 15 minutes to go get my lashes done and then come back and go across the street from where I live to get my um, to get my nails done. And then if I get my hair done, that's it. No more maintenance this week because I got to put money in my gas tank. I ain't going nowhere this weekend except to my friend's grand opening. Let me shut up. I'm lying. I'm going to my friend's grand opening. She has a pole dancing studio that she's reopening. I'm going there to support her. Get my hair done Saturday. Sunday, I'm not going nowhere. And, and even after the pole dancing thing, I'm not going nowhere. Because gas high. Until we figure out this gas thing, I'm going to be at home. Okay? So, you know, this weekend vlog is more like maintenance and stuff. So, you go into the maintenance. And I'm going to go to the gym and stuff like that. But, um, I'm going to go to the grocery store. But I'm not spending a whole lot of money. I'm just not. We mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. sit down. Now, next weekend, I'm outside. <laughs> But this week, and it's supposed to snow Saturday. It's I'm in Birmingham, Alabama, so it's gonna snow Saturday. It is March. Why is it snowing? I don't know why I'm surprised. This weather is so bipolar here, you know. So yeah, it's gonna snow. Um, and so I'm not doing much on Saturday anyway, because it's gonna be cold and it's gonna snow. So yeah, I ain't doing nothing but going in my head. In. Hopefully, it doesn't snow. Too bad to where I can't get my hair done. Oh, shit. I ain't think about that. <laughs> oh, but next weekend, I'm outside. Mm -hmm, for sure. I'm outside, outside. Next weekend. For sure. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, I'm about to heat up some protein. Just a taco mix with um, cheese on top. And some salsa and a little sour cream. I had a smoothie uh, around 4 yeah, around 4.30. And so, that was protein smoothie. Getting some more protein in. Um, before I go upstairs and lay down for a second. Um, I'm going to the gym in the morning. Yeah, that's all I got going on. But, um, I love my nails, y'all. I love my nails. I'm glad I did this. I'm glad I went with a different shape because it's bomb. He's a bomb. Um, I have to, I'm going to get, you know, fill in and I have to use a new nail tech. My nail tech is having a baby. So her baby will be here like in the next two or three weeks. And so I have to go to a different nail tech. But this nail tech is fire too, just like mine. So that's the good thing about it. And she's at the same place um, across the street from where I live. So yeah, that's all I got going on. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I wanted to take this time to to um, thank you guys. I'm at a hundred subscribers. I'm gonna look back at this video when I'm at like a hundred thousand and be like, "Girl, 
you was excited about 100 subscribers. Yes, I am. I am. I'm glad. Thank you guys for rocking with me. Um, for putting up with me and shit. <laughs> I'm still figuring this whole thing out. You know, I'm still, you know, recording on my phone. And, you know, one day I'm going to get the equipment that I need to give y'all the content that you deserve. Okay? The content that you really deserve is coming. Okay? We have another haul coming up. Oh, I'm filming a video Saturday. I just thought about it. So, Saturday I'm filming a video. We are talking about friendship breakups in the video. I'm going to do a get ready with me. I ain't getting ready to go nowhere. <laughs> but I'm getting, I'm doing the get rid of me. And I'll show y'all me. I, I'm going to do that on my other camera, not on my phone. So, um, that's going to be Saturday. I'm going to film my get rid of me. Because then I've been doing my hair. And, yeah, I'm going to put my clip-ins in. And show y'all how I style my clip-ins and everything. And um, I'm going to do full get ready with me. Hair, makeup, outfit, perfume. All of that. So, I lied. I'm talking about I ain't got nothing to do this weekend. I got plenty to do this weekend. So, y'all gonna come for the right. Hello, and welcome back, guys. I am... Today is Friday. And I have been working and I'm off now. So I'm getting ready to go to Sam's and get some gas. And I'm going to shop there as well, go to the bank, all that good stuff. Um, today uh, has been like an emotionally taxing day. I honestly want to go out and have a drink or two, but it's gonna snow tonight. Yes, you heard it here in March in Alabama it's about to snow so yeah I'm probably not gonna go out I'm probably just going to go back come back home and drink some wine and watch a movie or something like that because I'm getting my hair done in the morning really early I pray that the roads are okay to where I can drive like it's like 10 or 15 minutes to get to her house for her to break my hair I really need my hair done because I'm wearing a poof right now yeah and so I really need my hair done. And she hadn't tested me and canceled my appointment or rescheduled yet. So we playing it by ear. So we're gonna get this motherfucking hair done. But yeah, I'm about to hit the road. Uh, it's about to be 440. So traffic's gonna get a little crazy. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit the road and I'll check back in when I get to the gas pump so y'all can see how crazy it is. Okay guys, it's loud in here, but I am like everything else finally. I have to go take her. I've only been in here like a few minutes and I got a man harassing me about something like a sausage. If you don't know what Connecta sausage is, Google it. It is a staple in Alabama and apparently the production of it has been stalled. And that man was mad. So these are the Chick-fil-A like look like I guess the dupe for the Chick-fil-A um, nuggets and I'm about to get them $13 and I'm gonna put them in the air fryer to make them a little bit healthier but I've been wanting to try them and they also have the Chick-fil-A's chick too so I got them this so far Okay guys, I am finally in line at, um, in at Sam's and I'm um, waiting because of course I'm paying cash because it's like my car hurt, but hey, that's the only way, you know, you sharing it as a family. I just need to get my own car and I just keep forgetting to get my own car, but hey, we in here, shit. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm just waiting in line to pay, and I'm gonna show y'all what I got so far. All right, this one is snacky snacks. Good morning. I know, I know. See, I'm terrible. I was supposed to um, hit y'all back up after I got my food, or when I got my food, 
yeah, baby, I got my food and I came home and I um I ate my food. I had company, so um had company and we just hung out or whatever. Anyway, so it's the next day. <laughs> Um, I went and got my hair braided. I got these just two braids right here. This is just something to hold me over until I get my actual braids. Like I'm getting tribal braids with knotless. So tribal in the front and knotless in the back. I'm getting those at the end of the month. So I needed something to kind of hold me over. This will hold me over for like two weeks. Um, as long as I wrap my hair, I mean, put the hair wrap on and also put these inside of my bonnet, I would be fine. Um, so yeah, so I hope y'all like it. I'm gonna turn around so y'all can see. It's just two braids. I was gonna get a braid, braid connecting, braid connecting, but I didn't, you know, I was just like, you know what, I'm just gonna get something simple. I'm not gonna get all the extravagant because that would have been extra. I think it would have been $25 extra. And so I was like, you know, I'm already getting extravagant braids. It's gonna be like $275 at <laughs> the end of the month. Uh, so when I get those braids, I'll definitely uh, set it up because it literally took about 40 my, 45 minutes to do this. I'll set it up for her to, um, for me to vlog. And so y'all can see the process of her doing my braids um, during that time. Um, I'm about to get something to eat real quick because I am starving. So we're going to go get in the car and I'm just going to get me something really quick because the next place we're going, we're going to pole dancing class. My friend Naya Jackson is reopening her pole dancing studio here in Birmingham. She's having a grand opening today and I want to stop by and, you know, support because sis is got it. She got it. She teaches pole dancing, twerk fitness, triple exercise. So that's like X, X, exercise. She um she's doing a damn thing. So shout out to Nia Jackson. You you doing it, girl. You is doing it. So I'm um, go and support her. And then I'll come back home. Let me tell you something. It snowed this morning, guys. Yes, in Alabama, in the middle of March, it snowed. So it snowed. So um it's not, it's ice outside a little bit. But this morning I thought I was gonna make it to my hair appointment. But um I did it the roads were okay and then i put that car in snow mode <laughs> and we made it there so but um the ice is melting but it's really cold it's like 33 degrees here today and tomorrow the time changes we lose an hour of sleep which is fine because then we gain an hour of daylight and listen for your seasonal depression people that is major 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 uh seasonal depression people that um, you know, usually get depression around this time. It's almost over, guys. It's almost over. But, um, yeah, it's really cold outside, so I'm going to dress really, really warm um, when I go out there. But I'm going to wear, like, something, like, you know, to work out in. But I'm not going to work out because this type of hairstyle, yes, it's gelled down real good. It's got to be glued real good. But I need it to last for, like, two weeks okay so in order for me to do that the first couple of days i don't need to work out so today i'm not working out but i'm going to support her for sure uh i need to make me a little snack i might just make something because i went to sam's yesterday and i got these guys i'm trying to see these are so if you ever had nan bread nan bread is so good it's like a pita bread but better um, so these little nan breads, I take these nan breads and I make little sandwiches with them. And I got some honey roasted, I need some coffee too. Honey roasted turkey breast. I got that. And I also had some turkey breast already in here. I love this carved, this uh, carving board turkey breast from Oscar Myers. So I'm going to make me some little nan sandwiches with this i got a full thing of turkey i need to go and use that and some cheese oh i'm out of cheese yeah i'm out of cheese i should have bought cheese when i was at sam's but um i'm gonna make a little snack and then go upstairs and get ready i honestly need a meal so i'm gonna make me a little snack and if after i take my bath and everything again if i'm hungry i will go get me something to eat because i'm starving anywho 
yeah so that's what's on the agenda today you guys my little fit i'm gonna put on um when i get done getting dressed um but right now we finna eat our little nan sandwiches and watch tv for a minute because it doesn't start to noon i mean i'm not gonna go until one o'clock i don't like going places like it's from like noon to six i'm going at one i still have time <laughs> so yeah that's what we're doing today i hope y'all have a happy saturday it's uh, if it's cold where you are bone the up if it's warm where you are i envy you so i don't care i don't care so it's probably warm in florida or somewhere like that but anyway we're about to see i'm gonna show y'all the little sandwich that i made i take the little nan bread put some turkey on there mm, really good all right i'll catch y'all in a minute all right so i haven't been doing my makeup um hold on done my makeup now i'm about to put my earrings on and i don't i don't really want to wear what i got on i have on those leopard print tights that i have i'm probably gonna change into some like a, i have like this snake skin bodysuit that i've been wanting to wear um i wear that mm. i might wear that but this is my makeup look i am loving it i did my brows before i did my makeup it always makes a difference it always makes a difference when i do my brows first um when i do my brows like when i clean them up and stuff um these things that i'm putting on the back of my ear is for my earrings to hold up i one of my ear lobes is ripped and the other one is trying to do the same thing so i'm trying to stop that from happening so uh i don't know what earrings are wrong i'm probably gonna wear some hoops i got some hoops some gold hoops i, I don't wear flashy earrings like i used to so i'm gonna go with these these gold hoops yeah i don't i don't wear and i need to put another one i need to, i usually do two on the back of this one because is broken now i don't plan on doing all the pole dancing and stuff i'm just going by there to um you know talk to her and to vlog i told her i promised i would vlog so people can see you know that we have a pole dancing studio in alabama well in birmingham to be more specific so what i'm about to do i will show y'all my outfit um i'm supposed to be doing the tiktok of my nails i love my nails they are so fucking cute but um i'm gonna do a tiktok of my nails and i'm gonna get dressed real quick and i will come back when i'm done getting dressed and stuff but I'll take this off now because i gotta Put some powder on my hairline because I forgot I had the hairline covered. So now you see there's a line on demarcation. So I'm just going to take this and this has a little powder left over on it and look just like that. It's blended in. But yeah, I thought my hair looked cute. I got a... Um, Get this together here here in the back. There we go. I look cute. Mm -mm 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 -mm. <laughs> hey y'all. I am at Pole PYT Studios. Pole yourself thin. That's what the PYT stands for. I am glowing today. Yes, I'm glowing. Anyway, I'm about to get out the car. Um, I'm about to get out the car and go in here. There's no one to park. So I hope that they don't try to tow my car because then we'll have to fight and she's going to have to give me some money back. I'm just playing. But I'm going to ask her when we go in there um, if we can park over here because it has a sign that says it's only for some type of school. But I mean, the school's not open today. Like today is Saturday. So um, 
they have a sauce barbecue over here. I did not know that. But sauce costumes, they wings, they want twenty dollars for ten wings, and no, we don't do that, baby. Um. Anyway, I'm about to go in here, and I'm gonna take y'all with me. You're gonna vlog. You're gonna meet the owner. Her name is Naya Jackson, as I stated before. We're going to go in here. I'm not. I'm definitely not going to. I'm gonna get on the pole, but I'm not going to be doing much. Okay. But yeah, so uh, I'll catch y'all when I get in there and I'll start vlogging. And I probably won't have, you won't hear the music because I, of course, copyright claims. Yeah. I am at PYT Studio. Pull yourself in. Uh -huh. This is the owner, Naya Jackson. Hey. Naya. Hey. Okay. Yeah, we're well, going to come in. Do you have Thanks. any questions for me before we walk in? Yes. Tell okay. me about your business. So this is PYT Studio. I have been open since 2009. I specialize in teaching women pole dancing, but it's deeper than pole dancing. It's about confidence, sexiness, learning, understanding how to move your body, how to isolate hips from hands, from feet. We don't use our legs to move our titties. Mm -hmm. We don't use our titties to pop and pop. Yeah, yeah. It's all separate. Yes. So I teach you how to work the mechanics of your body, body mechanics understanding how to feel sexy inside and out no matter what shape size or color you are mm -hmm. we are sexy because we are women women are like snowflakes we're all individually different none of us are built and made the same but we're beautiful mm -hmm. yes thank yes. you <laughs> now give us a swear babe because you look good yeah. yes <laughs> all right let's yes we got two edible uh rotel and edible oh, <laughs> oh, you, uh, yeah. Sign your name, get a mark on uh, the Okay. Mm -hmm. I got to turn on, I got to turn on the flash. I can't see. All right. One, two, three, four. Brass skin, lift the lid. Okay. All right. Some of y'all run around like little roaches, you know? Yeah. All right. No, no dead little roaches, okay? You know the roaches die their legs up. Like this. So no little roaches. We are ladies. We're gonna cross our legs at the ankles. Open the legs. Cross. There you go. Yes, like a lady. So try it one more time. So I look all nice and tall. I'm a roach. Five, six, seven. Walk it. One, two, three, four. Grab, swing, spin. Okay, okay. Don't be a roach, don't be a roach. <laughs> all right, so third time to charm. Remember, walk up and hold high. Hold all the way high. Reach above, nice and tall. Swing the legs and then lift to spin. Last time. Nice and tall. Five, six, seven. Walk it. One, two, three, four. Grab spin, take off. Okay, watch <laughs>
Okay, guys, I am back. I just left out of Naya's pole dancing grand opening. It was bomb. We had so much fun. Like, it was so much fun. And I'm going to take on her classes and I'm going to vlog it. Um, it's going to be her pole dancing class on my channel very, very soon. So, top notch grand opening. I loved it. Um, so, I'm about to. Go get something to eat, something else to eat. I'm so hungry today. I really ain't been eight today. So I'm about to go somewhere down here um, on the south side of Birmingham and get me something to eat because I am so hungry. Um, so I will catch you guys on my way back to my destination. <laughs> Sunday, Sunday, March the 13th. I am currently about to, I already had my coffee as y'all saw. I ate a little snack. I'm kind of hungry, I ain't gonna lie, but I'm about to clean up down here. As you can see, it looks a like full stuff all over my couch. And so I'm gonna um, clean up in a second. But child, last like yesterday. Yeah, we ain't gonna talk about yesterday. Yesterday was crazy. It was so crazy. We had fun pole dancing, as you saw. Um, we had a twerk contest. It was just crazy. Um, I can't wait to take one of Nia's classes because it's gonna be dope. I definitely take. I've taken her twerk fitness classes, so I mean, took twerk fitness. So, but I'm about to. Um, clean up my house um let y'all see that you know i'm not a shame you know i'm a working person and um i usually keep my house pretty clean it's just i sometimes i leave stuff on the couch sometimes i leave stuff on the um on the on the um the dining room table so i'm human um, sometimes, you know, people think that people who vlog and stuff are perfect, like a house be clean all the time. We're humans too, and we have a life as well. So, you know, we don't, if everything isn't perfect for you when you see it on the vlog, you know, then that's good. It means that I'm not trying to make it perfect for you. I'm just being me. I'm being my authentic self. So, um, I'm about to clean up. I look so tired. I went to sleep at 7 o'clock. It was like 7.30. Yeah, I was exhausted. So, um, anyway, I'm about to clean up and I will show you guys me straightening up the house.
you see it as winning in the back. There's no winning in this game. It's not some white knight on the stage. She's not some fairy tale princess. She's just as fucked up as you are. This is incredible. Tap as you are.
Jesus. She's just as fucked up as you are. This is incredible. Hey everyone, it's me again. Um, so as you see, I'm dressed and I'm getting ready to go to run my errands. I'm going to go to Trader Joe's and I'm going to go to the grocery store, like Walmart, Publix, love Publix. That's my jam. Um, going to Publix uh, for a few things. I was going to Publix first and then Walmart. Hate Walmart's customer service. Love public customer service, so it's really customer service versus the price. Don't mind paying a little extra to have good customer service. So going there, um, done cleaning it up as you can see. House looks nice and clean. So um, I mopped the floors. I swept the floors, mopped the floors. Uh, pretty much cleaned up a lot of stuff. I gotta take the trash out. Um. So I'm just wearing this jacket is from Forever 21. And I've had it so long, maybe like four years. And then I got this bodysuit from Shein. These pants are just $6 sweatpants from H&M. My shoes are Converse. So I have on Converse. Let me see if I can step back. Converse, um, Converse platforms. Um, super comfortable. I love Converse platforms. Um, these are a little too big. They do run big. And earrings, Forever 21. Rings, Forever 21. Still loving my nails. Uh, what else? I don't have on any makeup today. But, you know, it's all right. I got my lashes on. I still look cute. Oh, excuse me. I didn't want to be too, too fancy. I don't like how these sweatpants sag. In the seat part, they're too big. <laughs> I know they're too big, but um, it was six dollars. Okay, I, I can deal with it. I'm gonna tighten them up a little bit more. I was going to Target too. I'm going to Target, it's a couple things I saw I need from Target my hair vitamins and uh, just a couple of things from, from there. I'm gonna look and see what they got at this particular Target. They this particular Target is next to a college, so they have more cuter clothes. And this one versus mine. Mine doesn't have that many cute clothes. No. Anyway, but I'll um when I get in the car, I'm gonna set up my thing so I can vlog in the car. So when I get in the car, I'm gonna I'm gonna get back with y'all. Come on me, leave all of your things, yeah. You can stop at Gucci, stop at Louis V. Yeah. Come on me, fly you out to grief, full speed, so for the belly. Yeah. Sleep. 
Hey guys, I am pretty much done with my errands. I um I am, I am leaving Target. Of course, you can't go on Target without Starbucks. I got a dragon fruit um, refresher. Uh, no, dragon fruit mango dragon fruit lemonade. That's what I got. But I got it with no classic syrup or any type of sugar besides the lemonade. Uh, because, you know, I'm trying to cut back on the sugar. I was so damn thirsty. I really was. But, um, I have some good deals at Target. Um, I got my hair vitamins. Some more, um, body wash. And, um, my body patches. I use the brand from Walmart. And I like it. Not at all. So, I got my regular body patches from Target. But, I'm getting ready to head to get something to eat. This is my first time really eating a full meal today. So, I'm about to go do that. And, um... Let me get out of this parking spot. I don't know what I want to eat. What should I eat? What do y'all eat on Sundays? Do y'all eat like a heavy meal on Sunday? I feel like every time I vlog, my nose stopped up. <laughs> but um, do y'all eat a heavy meal on Sunday? I try not to eat really, really heavy on Sunday. But sometimes you just be wanting a good soul food plate. And my grandma is, she's 30 minutes away from me. And I'm not able to go to her every Sunday because I'm, I use Sunday as like my reset day. And, you know, driving 30 minutes there, 30 minutes back is a lot. So. But, yeah, sometimes you want um, a little soul food plate on Sunday. You know, your mac and cheese, your greens. Good food. I don't live in a place, I don't live in an area that has all that good soul food you know usually soul food places are going to be in my in my community is in the black communities i don't live in a predominantly black community anymore i'm from one but i don't live in one right now um so we we're not gonna have that type of shit out here we got you know fancy restaurants and stuff like that right here because this is where I get the most sun in my house these are absolutely gorgeous I trimmed them and I um, took some of the old leaves off and these are absolutely gorgeous just gorgeous yes I love them um yes hey everyone so I'm about to film the video finally <laughs> I just wanted to hop on here and tell y'all that I'm filming a video and tell y'all what it's about because I might post the video before I post my vlog. Even even if I don't, pretend like you don't know, okay, when you watch the vlog. But it's on friendship breakups. I'm going 
and going to extensive detail about the friendship breakups I have experienced. And I have two people who gave me their testimony. I asked people on Instagram about their experience with the friendship breakup. And I have two that stuck out, one for, for a male and a female. I didn't know that men really went through friendship breakups, but it's definitely a thing for women. Um, and so I got a fresh face. And um, I'm about to do my makeup and talk about friendship breakups, how to get over them, what that may happen, and my testimonials and some other people's testimonials and how to let go. How to let go of this person. You might have been friends with them for so long, but you can make new friends. So I just wanted to hop on here and tell y'all that. And yeah, it's going to be really nice. I promise y'all a, a video. I'm trying my best, but this camera working against me. It stopped it at 12 minutes, and I'm like, bro, I'm glad my sister called. Okay, guys, so I'm about to wind down for the night. I do have to work in the morning, so uh, I do have to go to the gym as well. Go to the gym at 6.30, 6.15-ish. Um, so... I'm about to get ready for bed. I'm tired. I'm going to lay down or whatever. I'm going to go to sleep, of course. I'm watching Doctor Strange. Um, I am ready for Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, uh, whatever it's called. It comes out in May. I got to see it. I'm a huge Doctor Strange fan, a huge Marvel fan. So it would be great to see him. In this movie, I cannot wait for it. I'm waiting on the tickets to come on sale so I can go ahead and buy my ticket and go see this movie in May. So, what's your favorite Marvel movie? Let me know in the comments. But thank y'all for tuning in. I'm about to wind down for the night. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so you can see whenever I post. Um, yeah, just make sure that you subscribe, um, like, comment, and I, I'm, I'm going to talk to y'all in the comments. Like, if I ask y'all a question in the vlog, answer it in the comments, and then I'm going to interact with you. So, thank y'all for tuning in to another vlog. I hope y'all have a great night, honey.